You feel that? A little chill in the air, days are getting shorter, nights getting longer. That means it's fall and winter is right around the corner. I'm meteorologist Jason Myers and it's time for the 2017-2018 winter weather outlook. That's where we look ahead to the months of December, January, and February. And this year, NOAA's forecast is relying heavily on what looks like a developing La Nina. There's about a 55 to 65 percent chance this one could develop. And across the country, that means the country is divided in two. In the southern half, we're looking at warmer air in place, especially in parts of New Mexico and southern Texas. It's going to be more than likely a milder, warmer winter. But some of that warm air could work its way up into parts of, uh, looks like the mid-Atlantic and maybe even the northeast with a 40% chance for some warmer air there. The coolest air is more than likely going to be in the northern plains, northern Rockies, and the Pacific Northwest with a 40% chance for increased cooler temperatures in that part of the country. In between, we'll likely have have uh, any equal chances, which means more than likely we're going to see temperatures bouncing back and forth between those above average conditions and below average conditions. As for the precipitation, it's going to be dry across the southern half of the country, especially in parts of Florida where we have the greatest chance to see some of that dry weather, Florida and Georgia. In the northern half of the country, we're looking at wetter than average conditions, and that means both rain and snow, and La Niñas are notorious for bringing additional snowfall to the Great Lakes region, and that is shown here with a 40% chance of increased precipitation across parts of Michigan, Illinois, Indiana, and Ohio, and a few of the surrounding states as well. And it looks like in the northern Rockies, even parts of the northern plains could see some wetter than average conditions, so expect some additional snowfall there. This forecast from the Climate Prediction Center is relying heavily on a La Nina, which there's about a 55 to 65% chance one is developing, but for most of us, it looks like a milder winter, but that doesn't mean we won't be seeing any snowfall. The last two winters have been very mild winters, but we still saw some significant snowstorms along the way. Regardless, be prepared and pay attention to the forecast in these upcoming months because, well, we're more than likely going to see snow in a few parts of the country. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And as always, subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this one.